Norm McLeod, 241 Sand Road. Um, I'm pretty concerned about uh, the way Puget Sound Energy is going about uh, the election on whether or not the PUD should pick up authority to get into the electrical utility business. This vote is about a whole lot more than whether or not we're going to take over Puget Sound Energy's distribution network in this, in this county. This is about whether or not the PUD would have the authority to generate electricity to <coughs> go into the alternative energy business. I know they're interested in tidal energy and uh, wave energy, wind energy, and, and solar. And if, if the mill ever does go out of business, it would also give them the authority to operate the generating facilities there. Puget Sound Energy has gone out and they threw up signs all over the county in the right of way and leaning up against stop signs even. Um, and I called the, the PDC and I learned that uh, they can mischaracterize the nature of the election if they please. It's their opinion. I would hope that there would be some action within the county from our official levels to, do, to come out and say, this is not the purpose of the election. It's not about a government takeover of Puget Sound Energy. It does allow the PUD the authority to investigate whether that would be a good cost-benefit thing to do or not. And then checking around a little bit deeper, um, they throw out this 19% rate increase. That's, you know, a pretty big threat. They fail to mention that over the course of five years, they'll be going for about 30% on their own hook. They don't mention the five layers of holding companies between the utility customer and the head chef. We have to pay for those useless layers, that shell game that takes place between the customer and the company. So through their greed and uh, their lack of ethics, I've come to the conclusion that my vote will be going against Puget Sound Energy's little operation here. You know, big oil is one thing, but big watt, it turns out, is much worse because you don't have a choice to go to a different electric station. One of the things that is bothering me about this whole deal is that their opposition campaign is operated out of a public relations firm in Seattle. And the treasurer for the um, effort is a lawyer in Seattle. He's the treasurer for the effort in Island County. He's the treasurer for the effort in Skagit County. And they have stated to the newspaper that they will do whatever they can prevent the PUD being granted the authority to do the things they won't. Thank you, Norm. Do you have anybody else? <clears throat> 